everyone, it's Kelsey here, and today I'm going to share with you a layout that I made using the Dear Lizzie Serendipity um, collection. Um, so I got this idea from Kate Kennedy on YouTube. She goes by Crafting Kate, and she got the idea from, I believe she said Tuesday Hubbard. So yeah, I thought it was just kind of funny that... Um, you know, she got inspiration from it, so I got inspiration from it, even though I'm not subscribed to Tuesday's channel. So basically, she used the Amy Tangerine Stitched Collection, which I really loved the colors in that collection, but I couldn't bear to cut them down yet. Um, definitely a problem that I have. But I really like these Dear Lizzie colors as well. So basically, all I did was I cut about four inch strips of patterned paper. And I cut those in half, so I had basically two four by six pieces of each pattern paper that I chose. Um, and they were just one sided because they came in the paper pad. Um, and I started out with that white sheet, and I wanted it to be really light and airy, and I really loved that look. But ultimately, the colors from the Serendipity collection were just a little too bright and light and white <laughs> to really work. So I ended up using this dark blue background instead of a white on that green marbled look and I really really like it. So yeah that's that's how it's gonna go. And I um, border punched all of these with that lace border punch that you can see up there in the left hand. Um, corner just because um, that takes forever and you don't need to watch that <laughs> um, so basically I kind of got the layout that I wanted and I started stapling all these together because I thought it would be quicker than um, uh, taping them all together um, or using my like dot adhesive runner or whatever um, but really stapling did not turn out that great it came out a little bit crooked and some of the staples ended up showing so, yeah, my advice would just be take the time, line them up, and um, just use the tape runner because that's what ended up working out the best. But I really love this new Dear Lizzie collection, and I love the combinations of the pinks and purples and white. It's, I feel like her collections um, are always, like, very light and happy, and um, even though there are, like, key elements that I don't love... I still love her collections overall, and this is definitely no exception. I love that pink polka dot paper that's on top, and I also love that um, striped paper that I used, that one you can see there, and the star paper that was the background, or the constellation background. I love that page. So, um, and, as, and as you can see, I used a ton of adhesive anyway, <laughs> and then I just kind of fluffed up the little lace border pieces. Um, even though those go in a page protector, maybe they'll still retain a little bit of texture. And then I just, I had printed out this photo. It was a selfie. I took part in, um, are you Kristen? Um, I don't know. She's over on Instagram and her Instagram handle is are you Kristen? And she does like a Thursday selfie challenge. And so I had taken it last Thursday and I just really like this selfie. Um, I just like the way it turned out. And I just made it black and white because I thought that would go better with um, a layout that I was going to do. I didn't know what colors I was going to use, but I figured black and white would always work and it looked nicer because <laughs> it's just a photo in my kitchen. Um, so I just thought it would look nicer in black and white. And I'm really glad that I went with the black and white photo because there are so many bold colors and um, I think it really would have clashed. So that's something I've been trying to do lately is print more black and white photos because I feel like maybe some of my layouts don't mesh as well because um, the photo has really weird colors in it. I wish that I took great photos full of bright sunlight, natural light, um, but the reality is that I don't. Most of the time it's very yellow, dark, winter evening light that I'm taking my photos in and just, you know not that pretty. So black and white is definitely my friend and I'm going to start using it a lot more. And let's see. I'm basically just trying to pull different things and find different things that are going to work. I really liked that puffy sticker um, that said today, which I thought worked better for, um, you know, the whole sentiment of like Thursday selfie, but that's, it just didn't end up working. Even though I really like the color, um, I just liked that pink 
with the rose gold hearts a little bit better. And then I, I really wanted to use one of those letters for, or those phrases from that phrase sticker collection, but it just wasn't working. So um, I decided to just go ahead and use this and I'm just titling it Selfie Thursday. And I used just a variety of the letter patterns and um, I know I said in my share video that I was a little reluctant to order this set, but then I went ahead and ordered it, and I'm really glad that I did because um, I don't think it'll work well with other collections, but I think it will work perfectly on collections from the Serendipity line, so if that makes sense. So <laughs> I just don't think it will pair well with other collections. It's not like a generic thicker. It's definitely a serendipity thicker. <laughs> so I will just have to make tons of layouts with this collection. That's that's the only answer to my problem, obviously. <laughs> so um, then, um, yeah, I just wanted to pull out some of these phrase stickers and just see. But the, the gold and white didn't really work. So I went with a rose gold with white on it, and I like the way that turned out better. And as you can see, I, literally everything that I used was from the Serendipity collection, which almost never happens, either because I don't have the whole collection or I think something will work with something else. But I think the colors in this kit are very specific. The navy and the pinks and the purples and the rose gold, I, I just haven't seen colors like this in any other collection. So that is going to wrap up the layout. So there are some other layouts there if you guys are interested in clicking on those. And if you could just hit that thumbs up or subscribe button, it really helps me out a bunch. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I will see you again soon. Bye.